Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Labyrinth of Galleria, Coven of Dusk. This is uh, episode two, and I'm picking up right from where I left off, which is right before this red exclamation point. Very foreboding. Let's see what it is. Oh, okay, some kind of raven thingy. Oh, it ran away. Uh. Okay. Oh, great, it called this big guy to come beat us up. But I believe it is the one that is going to get beaten up. Alright, let's see. This is our first boss battle, so, uh... I have no idea what to expect, but, I mean, it's the first one, so... Oh, jeez. Okay. It just one-hit KO'd one of my party members. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, alright, it's, uh... KOing them one after another. That's, uh... That's not good. Do I have any items? Can I use Donan to restore... Oh, it only works in live characters. Okay. Well. Uh, I don't really think there's much I can do except to keep attacking, so... Oh. Did I just lose? I just lost. Something tells me I was not supposed to fight that thing. Uh. Okay. Oh, maybe I was supposed to lose. やっぱり見えるかい。そして早くも全滅かね。これどうさんたちがどうしたらいいでしょう。まあまあ落ち着きな。こっからがあんたの出番さね。さあ、これ以上のことを強く念じるんだ。その思いは道しるべとなり、こ
えていませんなんとなくのイメージでしか感じられないというかところどころ抜けるというかあそれだけできれば十分とりあえず地下で見聞きしたことは逐一あたしに伝えなもし信仰に問題あればサポートできるからねそれに地下迷宮の中が噂通り魔獣の巣窟だったってことに確証が得られてよかったよえー、おばば様は知っていたんですか全人未踏って言っていたのにおやこいつは意外だねちゃんと前人未踏の意味を知ってたかい<笑>そうさ前人未踏ってのは誰も足を踏み入れたことがないって意味さでもねそれは迷宮内部の攻略についての話これまでも迷宮に挑んだ人間は実は大勢いるんだよそりゃそうだろうなんせこの世のものとは思えないほどの力を秘めた美術品が眠っているっていうんだそれを欲しがる連中は後を絶たないさ国王直属の調査兵からお宝目当ての冒険者に盗賊果ては魔法使いまで駆り出されたって話だけどまあ随分と昔のことだよ今はもう誰も挑んでああ私が調べた限りそうなるねある時期を境に挑戦する者も,も挑戦できる者も,もいなくなったここちらへ帰れないからそうだね当初は戻る方法を求めて探索していたようだけど結局のところ誰一人として生きて帰っては来ていない。でも戻った人はいないのに地下にいる地下があるってことは分かっていたんですか遺留品の中に地下で入手したと思しき知らぬ品があるほどまれにあったみたいでねその存在は分かっていたらしいねである時戻ってきた遺留品いやミンチの中に式があったですかああそうさそしてその最後のページには古い言葉でこう書かれていた「地下にうごめく凶暴な魔獣その正体は探索で死んだものもしくは生きたまま地下迷宮の正気に当てられた人間の慣れの果てだ決してこの迷宮に入ってはならない」。実はねワードローブに入ってミンチになるのは行きじゃなくて帰りらしいのさ向こうには行けるだけど戻れないってのが本当のところなんだでもその手記が見つかるまではミンチになると知っている人間がなぜワードローブに入ってしまうのか不思議に思われていた魔獣に追われ錯乱していたのかはたまた地上への帰還を目指す人間の郷愁が一か八かの無謀な賭けに走らせるのかとねだけどねかの者たちは魔獣として餌を求めて地上を目指していたなら話は別さええー、っそれが事実かどうかはもちろんわからないだけど時の国王がここを封鎖するには十分な理由だったんだそして長い月日が流れ迷宮に挑もうとする者は愚か迷宮の存在を知る者もほとんどいなくなったところで伯爵様が目をつけたってわけさ探索なんて無理ですよだって戻ろうとしたら死んじゃうんですよ<笑>そのための高齢とと、あんた、そのための人形兵じゃないか。さっきもちゃんと戻れたろう。人形兵の強さは、根本的には人間と変わらないけど、一
人ならざる者ならではの利点も多分にあるってことさでもさっきのイメージ本当に地下で起きていたことなんですかああそうさここのはるか地下で高齢とが人形兵を導いて探索をしていたんだけどあんたとの名約に基づいてももももしかして。私の仕事ってやっと気がついたかいあんたの仕事はさまよえる魂の折り城となりこの老いぼれに代わって地下での探索とその報告をすることさそそれじゃあうせもの探しっていうのもああそうだね地下迷宮から気品を探し出し回収してくることだ。私が探せるのってもっとこう単純ななくし物というかへへへへそうだねまあそのあたりは考えてるからね私に任せときなとは言っても探索の主体はあくまで高齢棟さ正確には高齢棟に宿りしさまよえる魂ってやつだけどねただこいつはひどく退屈が嫌いらしくてねせいぜいこいつを退屈させないようにしないと一体どうなるのかねあわわわわわわわほらそれじゃまずは挨拶しなどうだいなんか返事はしたかいあ、頭の中に声じゃないけど、高齢党さんの意思が流れてきます。えなんだこれ目的を果たすまでは一連託しあんたらは腐れ縁の夫婦みたいなもんさ。<laughs> Say, they're not going to get to Grena. Coco, if I monogarimus, Conochka, she was sending him cotton de Moyo, cane. Chica de Tenny, let us send him a Kihon taking Coconi to Basare Tecrenosa. Hm, Saki no Kuichi can hold on a tansak de. いくつか地下の物品を持ち帰っているねどれはあでもやっぱりよう皮脂でいければ安く上がると思ったんだけど破れちまっちゃ修理ができないやっぱり木製の人形兵じゃなきゃダメだねまあいいさ費用は旦那様にたんまりいただくとしてそのためにも改めてもう一度探索を行おうかそれじゃ上に戻って早速人形兵を作るよさあもう一度こいつに息を吹きかけなあ,あはいコーレイトーニョお嬢ちゃん改めて言うからしっかりと聞きなまずここが赤のトリブーナガレリア級のギャラリールームでありこれから迷宮探索を繰り広げるための拠点だあんたたちの目的はこのガレリア級の地下に広がる迷宮に収蔵された美術品その中でも気品と呼ばれる品を持ち帰ること気品と一口に言ってもその見た目は絵画彫像宝飾品は優に及ばず家具や書物まで幅広い気候品になっているみたいだね。高齢党さんと人形兵さんたちに地下からその気品を探してきてもらえばいいってことですよね。そういうことだね。魂と人形で作る不死身のマナニア。人を超越せし不死のもので迷宮に挑むのさ。どうだい
理解したかいフシでもさっきはやられちゃいましたけど<笑>そりゃあ人形兵だって魔獣に引き裂かれりゃ死んでしまうさ少なくとも地下ではねだけど元は人形だからね心臓が貫かれていようが首がなくなっていようがこちらに連れ帰れば何度でも修理がでそういう意味で不死身さもちろん正気に当てられても人間のように簡単にくたばっちまうこともないただこいつらはマナの力で姿を変えるんだマナが少ない地上では権限できない直接やり取りもできないのが。難点ではあるねモノああ宙に耐えた魔法の力の根源というべき元素さこいつがないと魔法は使えない根源元素まあ簡単に言えばマナが薄い地上では人形兵は実体化できないってことだよそしてそのためのいわば地下での司令塔が高齢塔ってわけさ<笑>それに人形兵たちも作られた時のままじゃないよ戦いを繰り返すことで成長するのさ地下で経験を積めばより強力な魔獣にも勝てるようになるだろう何度も同じ相手にやられたりはしないどうだい探索における人形兵高齢塔の役割とその重大さが理解できたかいあ、あ、はい半分くらい<笑>半分も分かれば上出来さあんたはその橋渡しだ習うよりなれよまあおいおい覚えていきなよし、それじゃまずは改めて準備を開始しようかねほら、こいつを使いなうん、Thank you Okay, so now I get to form my Witch Brigade.、Um, I don't want to force you guys to watch me go through these boring setup steps, so I'll probably cut the video short here and transition to the next part where I'm back in the dungeon. So, yeah, see you in a bit. Hey guys, thank you for sticking around.、Um, so, I have finished creating my very first. Witch Brigade, and I guess I'll、uh, show you the members really quickly before we proceed with the story. So,、uh, I'm a big Chrono Trigger fan, and I couldn't resist making my first three puppet soldiers Chrono Maru and Lucca. So, I've got a Peer Fortress for Chrono. For Lucca, I've got,、uh, I believe she's a Mad Raptor. And then for Marl, I made her, I think it's,、um, what is it called? A Wonder Corsair? I think it's a new. Class or new facet for this game. I don't think it was in the last game, but correct me if I'm wrong. Anyway, I don't know if this is optimal. I have no idea what I'm doing really. So、uh, let's、uh, just dive right in, see what happens. All right, let's get on with the story. Yes, I think it's a good idea. 私も材料なしじゃ何も作れないからね材料費はしっかり地下で稼いでおくれないよ地下にはお金もあるんですかさあそれはどうだろうねもしかしたら貨幣の類はないかもしれないねそうですかはあでも地下から持ち帰った物品であれば武器だろうがゴミくずだろうが旦那様の方で全て買い取ってもらえる契約だからね
それを探索費用として必要な品物を揃えたらいいさ私がここで雑貨店として仲介してやるよもちろん手数料はいただくがね<笑>手数料とか取るんですか何言ってんだいこっちもいろいろと入り用なんだしっかり売り値に上乗せするよそんなそれと一部の品物は後でまた必要になるかもしれないからね買い戻せるようにしておくさあと他にはそうだねこの鈴をいくつか渡しておこうマナニアならワードローブ以外からでも無理やり帰還できる魔法の鈴だま、魔法の鈴そうさ、こいつを地下で使えば一瞬でこちらに戻れるだろうよただこいつは作るのに時間がかかってね結構な貴重品だから計画的に使いなよやれることありますか高齢党さんをお手伝いしたいですなんだい急にやる気が出てきたねそれじゃあその高齢党さんがやりたいことがありそうだったらそれをしっかり手伝ってやるなまあこいつが地下で探索をしている間に一通りの手順は覚えてもらうけどねはいそれじゃあ高齢党さん何かあれば何でも言ってくださいね何にもなくても言ってくれていいですよあ、でもさっき見たイメージだと地下は穴があってそれ以上は進めなさそうでしたけどあ、どうかしましたかあ、あ、そうだったねそうそう、それでいいんだそういうことを報告してくれるあ、穴があるってんなら、まずはこいつを試すかね。これで少しくらいの穴なら飛び越せるようになったはずだよ。そして、次はこいつ。おっと。Oh, I'm getting a lot of powers. Kore de Maju. Iwaba, taking a singing de kiru yoni na ru hazu sa. Sugoi, sugoi. Kore to sa. Kore de koi de kito a tataka na kte mo sumimasu ne. So it's a muri da to mo ke do. Kachime no usui de kito no tataka yo sa keru no wa. Atashi mo san se sa ne. よーく見れば弱い相手と強い相手見分けがつくかもしれないしね<笑>みんなまで言うなって顔してるよあんた探索を始めたくてうずうずしているんだろうそれじゃもう一度だけ言うよ目的は地下迷宮に侵入しそこに眠る美術品こと気品を回収することまずはそうだね、気品を一つ持ち帰ってもらおうかさああとはあんた次第だいろいろと考えてやってみることだねそそれじゃあこれとさん頑張ってきてくださいね応援してますから I'll do my best but no guarantees did get my butt kicked last time I went down there so let's see if anything changes this time around alright turn bells jump Sense enemies, visualize enemies. Okay, so oh, we've got a few more options available on the menu now. Let's uh just skip all of these and go right to the mission. Okay, new field has been added. First level of the dungeon.
Okay. Interesting system here. All right, let's try this again. Wait, what did that say? Okay, sorry, I didn't read this properly the first time. Okay, so that's what that's for. I did not know that. Okay, let's see if I can uh, do better this time. I can revive the puppets I had before. I just realized I probably can, but for now I'll just keep going. Side of battle. I don't even know if that's possible. I'm gonna use my first aid skill, but I'm not sure if I can. Oh, that thing follow me? It's kind of creepy. Good, we got a sneak attack on it. There we go. Awesome. Alright, this is going smoothly so far, but... Actually, let me take this chance to go back and just see if I can add more puppets to my Witch Brigade, since I imagine the more the merrier in this case. Okay, that's good to know. I think I skipped the message again. Okay.
Oh, that's not good. I'm gonna try to avoid that at all costs. Workshop. Oh, okay, so I cannot repair. That's good to know. <laughs> Sorry, I think I just wasted a bunch of time for nothing. Alright, let's just go back in then. I'm only meant to have three party members, I guess, at this point. Hmm. Seems to be the same place as last time, except now it's green instead of red. Oh, this is where we get to use jump, huh? Let me, uh, let me give this another shot. Oh. Oh, good. The beast is gone this time. <laughs> Thank goodness. Okay, so we need to find a switch. Jump. Oh, hello. Is it the mushroom again? No! Ooh, it's a new one. A barrel of goo. Ugh. Alright, let's focus on the pumpkin first. Okay, so the Mad Raptor's attack is effective on the pumpkin. Actually, they're all effective. Must be pretty weak to, uh... Oh. I think it's casting a spell. Hope we can kill it before it does that. Okay, I kind of want this guy... Yeah. To tank the damage. Oh, never mind. It's, it's gone. <laughs> I thought I was going to do something really nasty. Oh, that's a lot of XP. Oh, hey. Excellent. I still feel like I'm not fighting as efficiently as I could be, but I'm sure that'll, I'm sure that'll come with time. I'm still trying to figure out what's weak to what, what's effective against what. This game has a very intricate battle system. I can see why it's become such a popular series. So now we can go back to where we were. 
for. Wait, how can I? Did I get into this room? Okay. Oh, I must be going blind. <laughs> oh, are you are you serious? Did I not? Ouch. That sucks. But uh, I did reach the basement floor, so hey, maybe that was a blessing in disguise. Okay. Yes, I did, in fact, realize that. Okay, so there is a point to filling out the map. That's good to know. And now the eye thing is after me. That's sucky. Sorry for all the tutorials, guys, but it is the beginning of the game, so I guess it's to be expected, huh? Go for lots of mana. Roger. Okay, there must be a stairwell back up to this surface. So. Hmm. I think we got a sneak attack. Nice. Uh, Four. That could be a problem. Let me focus on the battle thing first and have him tank. Okay, so he's drawing attention. And then, meanwhile, I'll target the pumpkin down. Oh wow, Marl's in trouble. It's not good. So Mal is apparently knocked out. I'm not sure how I can bring her back. Let's try healing her. So that was a lot <laughs> more a lot more difficult than it should have been, probably because I was scattering my attacks instead of focus firing. I might have to use some items to heal up. He has a lot of HP, wow. It almost makes me not want to use it, but uh, I suppose I should. Okay. OK, 
Okay, so I thought the character menu would allow me to use Donum, but maybe not. So I'll just keep going. Okay, awesome. something, since there should be a way to get back up to the surface. Maybe here? Here we go. This is what I was looking for the whole time. And this time, I'll remember to jump properly, I swear. Oh, sweet. That makes sense. Yeah, I'll have to optimize my setup once I get back to the surface. Okay, I'm being chased by an eye. I really don't want to fight now if I can help it, since I'm a little bit weak. So let me get out of here. Hey, wait. Oh, not again, are you serious? And I just killed Lucka and Marl. Awesome. Okay. See, I thought that I would press jump on the tile after the one that I was at. I guess I miscalculated. Let's see if I can bring him back to life. Nope, I can't. All right, in this case, I think I might have to pull out and repair them. I'm sure the veterans among you watching this are like shaking your head in disgust at how bad I am at this game, but in my defense, this is my first dungeon crawler in a while, so... <laughs> I did not expect to be great at it by any means. Okay, this is my press circle. There we go. I don't know why I couldn't do that before. Um, actually, I might be able to walk back to the service at this point. I don't want to waste my bell if I can help it. I hope I can. Good. That was close. Okay. Actually, let's go back that way. And I believe they should take me back to the surface. Excellent.
Alright, so they still got experience even though they're dead. That's good. I might skip past a lot of these boring parts if uh, <laughs> they get kind of repetitive since I don't want to make a boring video. So uh, if you see sudden transitions in the video, this is why. I'm probably just skipping past some boring parts you guys don't need to see. Alright, back in we go. And this time, I would like to get to the mysterious artifact. There we go. Okay. Let's try equipping some of these things, actually. So I just got a shield. I think this could be useful. All right, I got a character. This, here we go. Now we can equip. Good to know. Okay, so either hand is fine. So, let's place one of these. Oh. Okay, so if I want to put the shield in his hand, do I have to like get rid of one of these? Like de equip them? Let's see. Yeah, that would do it. Um, I think that might be better, perhaps. Let's see. Plus 13 to attack. Yeah, this is much better for defense, so. Let's do that. And I think I might have... Ooh, that's really good. That's even better. Wow. When did I pick this up? I do not remember picking this up, but you know what? I'm not complaining. And it's an epic. I just realized now that there are rarities to these items. Okay. Let's do it. And I don't think I got anything for her. No. Let's uh, try to give her the strongest equipment. See if anything changes. Nothing changes. Okay. And does he have anything he can equip? Well, I do want him to have one of these since they're optimized for his class, I believe. So, yeah, I'll just stick with what he had on. All right, I think that's it for now. Apologies if I'm going in circles, but Quite sure where I need to go. Oh, that's right. I wanted to go through this door. I thought I already pressed another switch. I guess I didn't. And yep, I did it again, guys. Are you starting to notice a trend? I think I just have a thing for falling in holes, you know? It's just kind of my thing. It's just I'm so used to action games where you have to walk towards the hole and then press the jump button as you're walking towards it, you know? So, <laughs> that's my excuse. I'm used to playing action games where you have to physically time your jump instead of pressing a button a square ahead of the jump to do it automatically. Yeah, it'll take me a while to get used to that, to unlearn the bad habits I've developed from playing other games, but 
I will get used to it eventually. Um, let's uh, jump. Okay. Did we already press this one? Yes, we did. have to go back over here and find another switch, is what I'm thinking. Since I don't think that there are any other switches on this um, floor. Let me check the map. There's one switch over there, but I already pressed that. Yeah, I pressed both switches on this floor, which tells me that I have to go downstairs to find the next switch. Probably. Alright, so... Back downstairs we go. There are some treasure chests as well, but... So, yeah, let's go get them. They might have a rare weapon inside. Or not. Whatever. Let me get this one here as well. Alright, so it's just items, but it's fine. Nope. Not fighting. Not right now. It's just a poison removal item, so I'll still take it though. Crap. Uh, 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 oh, good, we canceled this attack. It's good. Oh, very strong. I still don't know how to activate resonate attacks on command. I'm gonna have to look into that. Alright, I'm probably gonna skip ahead if I don't find where I need to go soon, so I can spare you guys me running around in circles in this dungeon. But I think I have a good idea of where I need to go. Let's uh, test my theory. If I can get there... <laughs> Shots up there. Right. 
I said it'll take me a while before I'm used to <laughs> having to jump <laughs> one tile ahead of the hole instead of as you approach the hole. Yeah. Okay, there doesn't seem to be a switch down here either, so then what switch am I missing? What switch am I missing? Gonna skip ahead to where I managed to figure out. To where I managed to figure this out. Of that in my first dungeon too. Okay, and I just figured out where I need to go. Wow. Finally. Hmm. Cryptic. go heal before taking this part on. So I'm going to run back to the entrance and go back to the surface. I'm slowly getting the hang of this, but uh, <laughs> there are definitely going to be some growing pains, as you can see, learning how to not fall in holes like a million times. Learning how to read the map and not run in circles endlessly. Yeah, this is going to be quite a learning curve. But in any case, I made it back to the surface in one piece. Thank you for sticking with me this whole time, if you have. Um, there's probably going to be... There probably will have been some editing in this video since I did run around in circles a lot. And that doesn't make for a very exciting viewing. So uh, if you notice some transitions, just assume that's what it is. That I'm skipping past boring parts. Um, in the next video... I should be able to clear this dungeon and get the artifact, come back to the surface, and proceed with the story. So, hope you're looking forward to the next video. Stay tuned for part three, and I'll see you then. Take it easy.